so for today we're gonna be looking at the anthemic invocation pieces for the warlock so if you guys don't know we usually review the video right here we usually do the shader video right after which is also right here and then we go to the individual class videos so the hunter and titans both of yours are right here some of my best work for the titans and for the hunters as well some of the dopest pieces that i made definitely check those out warlocks you guys are no different a lot of these pieces are amazing there are i think one of them is another like a reuse not actually no not really because i did use those for another video but again i stand by all of these these are amazing they're bangers absolutely so let me know what you guys think in the comments below i appreciate you guys remember to hit the bell notification if you guys want to keep up to date with my current content like comment subscribe really does help keeps the channel basically alive and obviously youtube really likes that as well so i appreciate y'all let's just get into it so to start off we're gonna be looking at the helmet and i think this set looks amazing so for the helmet obviously in themic invocation hood for the arms we're gonna be using controverse hold with the grasp of the void ornament for the chest piece chasm of yule and then for the boots and the bond we're gonna be using carapace boots and bond so i actually like this one quite a bit for the shader we're using omnicronia for a very specific reason specifically because the shader or the uh the glow is blue and unfortunately anthemic invocation for pretty much everyone if you see eyes they're just gonna stay purple and from uh, from like just looking at it for real fast it looks blue so that's why i'm i went with a blue one instead because if i went with purple i feel like people wouldn't really have seen it <sighs> to be fair it looks blue to me but more like a blue purple but more blue than anything else either way i think this set came out amazing um i will say this isn't my favorite because there are some other sets in here that i'm just like yo that looks crazy good the third set is what i'm talking about but yeah let me know what you guys think really really like this one as for the next set we're going to be using the arms for this one the fallen substar is going to be the exotic we're using and this one i immediately thought of just po pointy po give me pointy bits so the fallen sun star has all those spikes the arms have spikes the the chest piece has spikes the boots kind of has a spike on the actual feet and then for the bond i didn't want to bond um i could use i could have used the uh the dinosaur one but i was like ah, i don't want to use that i think i already use it in another set anyways so for the shadering and silvered snare is what we're using for everything but the bond because the bond we're using iron to steel so that way we can turn off the bond so i definitely think this looks amazing i would probably switch out the shader for something a little bit more colorful but this one definitely is really really cool let me know what you guys think as for the next set we're going to be using don chorus for the exotic with the phoenix renaissance ornament for the arms carapace gloves for the chest piece we're going to be using anthemic invocation for the boots opulent strix boots because i want some glow at the bottom to mirror the top as well and then the ciceratops bond for more pointy bits so this one's really cool because the there's a glow on the actual like helmet the belt buckle and then the boots and i think it looks oh so good and the shader forbidden wish i just think look, looks amazing with this set. It, you very much look like a like what i would imagine an ahamkara to be in like human form kind of like just like it looks so good i'm sorry i'm sorry like it just it looks so cool um I, you i rarely never like really gush about a set that i make unless i'm like yo i'm really feeling it and this one i'm feeling it mr krabs like, i love this one this one's so good and even if you don't like forbidden wish which is completely fine I, I i get it it's not a great shader for most pieces but i think this one looks amazing but if you didn't want to combine it with this but you still wanted to have like bone color there are definitely some bone colors in this game that you can definitely use that would look amazing one specifically would be dreaming spectrum which is one of my favorites but there's so many good colors that you can choose from and you don't even have to pick a bone color you can just do whatever you want but i definitely think this is like one of my favorite sets that i've made on the warlocks and then last but not least, we're going to be using the look that I made for the Christmas armor for the Warlocks. Unfortunately, the armor is not available anymore. But if you want to check out the video, I'll have it in the description because I think I've already used four uh, URLs for, for this because it doesn't let me go to more than four. But this one's pretty cool for the helmet, Adivastic Idol Hood, for the arms, Claws of Ahamkara. And then for the chest piece, Opulent Strix robes with the Anthemic Invocation boots because... Uh, it all looks bird 
and then for the bond hex rot bond because uh, i wanted i wanted more color in there more specifically uh more glows in there so this one uh at the time was my favorite as well uh just because it looked super cool the shadering is different i'm using different shaders for this one or a different shader than the one i used in that video in that video i should have been using echo to anger this one i use vitrified duality because a i love the colors in this one i think the navy with the white with the purple with the gold i think it looks amazing and yeah vitrified duality is one of my favorite shaders like i i'm not i don't kid around when i say that in, a, in an ada video i legitimately mean it like a, vitrified duality is a really good shader and you guys are missing out if you don't have it so when i ha when i make those weekly videos and i show you what's up for the week make sure you pick up the ones i'm telling you to pick up because dude there's some hidden gems in this game so definitely one of my favorites just because it gives that bird feel so much the arms you literally have claws there the boots you literally have talons there not literal but like it's very much gives that vibe the helmet obviously has that bird feel as well and overall this is probably my favorite uh with the third one i think the third and the fourth one are just amazing so, so warlocks let me know what you guys think i definitely think a lot of these pieces are amazing i think honestly if i were to be really honest with myself i think the hunters lost this one just because the titans all of the sets i loved the warlocks all of the sets i loved i can't really say the same for the hunters like the first one's really cool the second one's really cool the third one's pretty cool but the fourth one is where i'm like i i could have i could have i could have i could have cooked more in the kitchen with this one but hunters titans warlocks let me know what you guys think which one had the best sets let me know in the comments below again i will be working on a few projects first and foremost we're going to be doing the crota armor that's literally going to be right after this uh the warlock video so be looking out for that because i finally got the chest piece for the warlock um we're going to do the same thing we did with with all the armor videos that i've done this season which feels like a lot now but review video shader video and then the the uh titan warlock and hunter videos so be looking out for that i'm also going to start working on the exotic videos finally because i have i've gotten people to or i've gotten people asking me for specific exotics which if you guys don't know i do exotic videos and more specifically i we go through what it does we go i show you like all the shaders that it, it go i show you shaders on the armor so that way you guys can see how it looks if it had, has any ornaments we also go through the same process and then we make an example set from that and then the ornaments also get an example set so i have a lot of them titans hunters warlocks i got i have a lot of those uh specific videos exotic videos and i would probably say the exotic videos are, is what really made my channel what it is now because those videos really got a lot of people's eyes so i'm gonna start doing those again i'm gonna start doing the the uh thematic videos which i think the first one's gonna be tactical and for that we're actually gonna do something a little bit different we're gonna be doing three sets for each of the classes because there's three classes so i decided to do three pieces for each of the classes and then i'm probably going to do it individually it's going they're going to be really short videos or i might just do all of them in one video let me know what you guys think but after that then we'll actually go like deep into it like i'll show you all of the uh tactical sets that we currently have and how to get them and my thoughts on them as well so let me know what you guys think again if you guys have any thoughts about some content that you guys might want to see me do let me know in the comments below uh that i will definitely let you know if i'm down for it or not but be safe i appreciate y'all i will see you guys later